Let's talk about Unity. Okay. Unity, of course, a classic, easy to use, highly popular game engine, game making thing. Yes. A lot of people use it. Like a lot of our favorite games are made in Unity. Mm -hmm. But so, for some reason, they're like, hey, we are going to, after you've hit a certain threshold, we're now going to charge you for installs. So every time a guy installs your your game, we're going to get a kickback from that. Yeah. And it's, it's like, like what? what? That's so weird. Well, then you said for some reason. Well, the reason's money. Yes, yeah, so the that's, reason is money. That's of course. why they yeah. want to do it. But it's like, I thought, I mean, maybe there's, I don't know exactly what the deal with Unity is. I would have assumed it's like, okay, you pay to make the game in Unity. Yeah. You license our engine. Yeah. That's the end of it. That will, should be the end but of it. But now they're like, well, we need a subscription model here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right? So we're going to do it. Once you reach a certain revenue threshold and a lifetime install account, count, they're going to be like, no, you have to pay. I don't remember what it was. I did the math. Someone said it on the thing. And it's like, it's not that much. It's 20 cents per install once their game hits 200,000 downloads and makes $200,000. Yeah. So I was like, okay, 20 cents, nothing crazy. But then, like, um, this company, Agro Crab, I think, they're putting their game on Game Pass. And they're like, okay, let's say everyone on Game Pass installs our game. 25 million people? They would owe $5 million. <laughs> and I did the math, and I'm like, wait, I must have done that wrong. That seems way too high. And it's like, no, that is That's correct. literally what it is. So, obviously, <clears throat> Unity, they want the money. And this is, I don't know, it seems stupid to me. Now, yeah. is this because when you install the game, like, does Unity have to install something on its own? Like, I, is it like kind of like when you would install a game and be like, oh, you need DirectX now? I don't, well, there is a runtime that or, comes with it. Or is it, that just bundled in the game? But it should just be bundled in the game. Like, you should be able to... I mean, what do you, you should be able to like put it on a disc and, and install it from like there, and that way you don't you don't get that thing. Yeah, you don't get charged for it. Yeah, yeah. And the other thing too is it says here like if it doesn't matter how many times you it's installed. Like if I installed it five times, that's he. I installed it five times. I have to pay like they have to pay for five installs. Yeah, even though I installed it the same person, right? Yeah. Very weird. So Unity is made by whom? It's, I don't know. So it's so like, is this not? It wasn't Epic. Just like yes, <laughs> nice play by Unity. Because <laughs> what's Epic's one called? Uh, Unreal. Unreal. Yeah. So Epic must have been just like you idiots. This is beautiful. <laughs> Surprised they didn't release a press release. Like, oh, you could install infinite number of times. It's fine. Yeah. Don't worry you can about use it. the Epic engine for free right now. You don't have to pay us a thing. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> and then if you reach a certain dollar value, then you do. Right? Yeah. If you, yeah, yeah. If you sell, you know, if you reach a million dollars sold, then yeah, we'll take we'll take some. Yeah. Exactly. I can't remember what it was. Yeah. It's something like yeah. that. Yeah. Yeah. This is so dumb. I know. It's like Unreal is making moves to make things easier for developers. And all of a sudden, Unity is like, eh. But I guess when yourselves. all you have is your engine, I'm assuming that's all they have. They don't have a game store like Epic or whatever. No, definitely not. So Maybe they're trying they to diversify. To, they're trying to get more money. Yeah. And it the, the fact that they put out, it's like, oh, and now if you install it per system, like the system manufacturer is going to have to give them money. Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Cover, yeah. Uh, the fact in question, which is still online at the time of writing, suggests corporations like Sony, Microsoft, <laughs> Nintendo, Valve, and Epic cover the runtime fee for each game sale of digital stores on PlayStation, Xbox, Switch, and PC. Oh, so they're saying like, oh, Microsoft should be paying for it, but as if Microsoft's going to pay for that. Yeah. There's They'll no way. pass no, on the, the fee to the developer, yeah, obviously. Yeah. yeah, that's ridiculous. Yeah. That's so stupid. Yeah. But then mm -hmm. news came out that the the bosses of Unity, mm -hmm. the you know, they sold two thousand yes. shares right before they announced that runtime fee. Jeez, that's sound so 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 okay. It's it sounds shady as fuck, you know that they did this. Yeah, but a lot of times these guys they have it scheduled ahead of time where it's actually registered. Like we are gonna sell. X amount of shares in four months time or whatever. Yeah. So it might not be that greasy, 
but it probably is that greasy. But yeah, a lot of times they do have it publicly, public information about what they're doing. <laughs> so, um, but that doesn't, that's not a good look. No, the, the guy has sold this guy, uh, John Richie, Rich, Richie Tellio. Okay. Has sold 50,610 shares this year alone and has bought zero. I mean, generally when you sell them, you don't buy them yeah. back right away, but whatever. Oh, yeah. They've been selling tons of shares for millions of dollars. Yeah. Yeah. All yeah, these yeah. guys. All these guys. That's a lot of shares to be selling. So, yeah, it's pretty <laughs> greasy anyways. Oh, buy Cult of Lamb now because we're deleting it January 1st. Wow. They're not even going to transfer it over to like Unreal or something like that? I, I guess. Um. But even okay, so like that's a good point too. Thinking of that, they're gonna delete it January first. It's already on Steam, right? Yeah, I already own it. Three years from now, <laughs> I, I reinstall it. They own, tw- I they owe twenty cents. Yep, yep. That's a ridiculous thing. What I if, uh, and, oh, man? Yeah, that's so crazy, dude. What a weird maneuver by them. Yeah, it's it's extremely weird. I don't understand why they're doing it. Yeah. So, I guess Cult of Lamb will be done, and then they'll just do Cult of Lamb 2 and Epic, or uh, <laughs> yep. Unreal Engine. Unreal, or Godot, or, you know, something else. Yeah. Yeah. It's so weird. Yeah. What a dumb play on their part. Yeah. <laughs> I agreed. <laughs>